What's going on, guys? So, uh, didn't post anything this weekend. Uh, as I said, I don't really have a posting schedule on the weekend. But um, anyway, hope you guys had a great weekend. And um, start of a new week, Monday. So, getting stuff done. Got some work done this morning. And um, just want to get some scraping done. So, on my shoulders, you saw the cover picture. Probably why you clicked on the video. Anyway, so I'm going to go over the benefits of scraping uh, fascia tissue and um, why I do it. I know it looks gross as soon as you get it done, but it, it's so beneficial. Um, it's something that I use a lot. And I, me personally, I have extremely tight shoulders. Anybody that benches probably anything at all, if you're benching over a plate, you're probably going to end up getting tight shoulders at some point. Just the reality. Um, so that's something I noticed. If you overwork it, you're going to have problems. It's like driving a car fast all the time. You're going to have to do maintenance on it. Um, so this is something that I use. So I go to a chiropractor who um, does the fascia scraping. He also does some other like adjustments because like I've tied either places, but regardless, fascia scraping in general. So your fascia layer is something, it's basically a web like, it's a web, it's a webbing matrix that basically goes through your entire body, holds everything together. And um, to get to it, you're going to have to do deep tissue massages or scraping. I like the scraping because it breaks up the scar tissue around the areas as well. So if you do something over and over again, you start to build up scar tissue. So in my shoulders in particular, right in here, like interior delt, um, stuff like that, lots of scar tissue build up. It gets just that tight feeling. Like if you take a broomstick and you hold it and you like go and try to do rotation. Sorry, I'm all sweaty because I just worked out. But um, and you like put it over your head. Um, that mobility gets worse and worse over time unless you work on it so I've been working on my mobility a lot but a lot of guys that bench press they don't do mobility they can't do that anymore they can't grab a broomstick and bring it all the way behind their head so that's something I work on all the time sorry I knew who that guy was anyway um so when you scrape it off and you break up the scar tissue it gives you more mobility more blood flow and ultimately it will allow you to grow bigger and get stronger because when you shorten so basically what you're doing is shortening your muscle too. So the scrape tendons, they do all that stuff, um, releases uh, buildup because things are not. So it's, how do I explain? It's kind of like twisting an elastic band and tying it. You have to, you have to open it up um, or else it's going to snap, really. Like, let's be honest. That's what we're doing to our tendons. That's what we're doing to our muscles. So guys rip their biceps, guys rip their chest, their pec. When they get super tight and they're doing flies and they're doing like heavy flies, they'll snap their bicep to tear their pec. So I'm doing this as a preventative measure and also it gets rid of a ton of pain. I really, really enjoy it. I go to a um, place I should call Integrated Health. It's in Colorado Place where I work out. So um, that's where I go. And um, yeah, I go to Ben Murray. He's awesome. Uh, if you want to, that's, what, that's just who I go to. And it's not, this isn't sponsored, it's just, I find he's awesome. So anyway, um, I go there and get it done, I'd say once every, I should be going once every three weeks. But normally it's like I don't go for a month and a half, two months. And then my shoulders start to get really sore and I go like five times through the course of two weeks. So should I be going more often? Yes. And um, ideally I'd be going just every week and getting it done as a preventative measure. Now, do you need to get it done? No, you can do stuff on your own. You can 100%, if you work on your mobility every day, you warm up your rotator cuffs properly, you lift with good form, you don't need to do this. Now, let's be honest, I'd rather versus spend, like I still warm up, but I say, let's say, let's say I warm up for five minutes. And if to get good mobility, I'd say you have to do about 15 to 20 minutes every single day to keep it really well. If you don't have to do scraping and other stuff like that. Me personally, I just could get the scraping done. If, because it opens it up and I don't know, I don't understand my body enough to know where to prod and get everything out. Like, yeah, obviously I can massage my shoulder a little bit, but personally, I really like it. Um, that's pretty much it. So breaks up scar tissue. Um, increases blood flow, uh, helps with, helps, so it gets more blood flow so you get more nutrients, um, helps with recovery, basically, so basically that helps with recovery, uh, lengthens your muscles, so a lot of great benefits to it. 
anyway, that being said, that's that's it for this video. So, because you guys have asked, like, I've um, posted pictures before, and you guys are like, man, like, that looks brutal. Like, why do you do that to yourself? This is why I do it. And, honestly, I go and work out right afterwards, which, because, like, it's basic, warms you up, right? Like, you get blood flow in your shoulders, you get a little bit of a pump because you're putting tons of blood in your chest. So, yeah, I get that all scraped. Went and killed a shoulder workout. was awesome. Uh, felt great. Had no pain, which is always lovely. So, um, it definitely works. That's, uh, that's my that's my experience with it. Anyway, hope you guys found this useful. Um, let me know. Have you guys ever gotten scraping done or do you do something similar? Let me know in the comment section down below. Also, if you're not sorry, if, oh my goodness, if you're not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. Hit the little bell button. Uh, appreciate all the support and hope you guys have an amazing week and I will talk to you guys soon.